hey guys welcome to my channel so as you saw the title of this video I'm going to share with you guys uh, my journey into getting braces a lot of people you know as soon as I started telling people like oh yeah I'm getting braces everybody's like you don't need braces unfortunately I do and there's a lot of reasons why people need braces and unfortunately mine is like a completely different situation I kind of wanted to tell you know basically talk about it and let you guys know the reason I'm getting braces um, it wasn't something that I wanted to get braces but it needed to get done a few years ago I believe I was <laughs> in high school I got my first molar uh, pulled out and the reason why was because um, it was very infected um, it just needed to come out so it wasn't a good tooth at all my dentist ended up pulling it out and of course at that time I did have two options one was getting an implant and two um, doing the bridge if you don't if you guys aren't familiar with those two i will link those down below provide a link so that y'all can um read about it those were my two options back then and i was very scared one and two at that time i didn't have the money for it so i kind of kind of or i completely ignored it i just didn't do anything about it here we are over 10 years later um and here's uh, the reason why I'm getting braces now. It was actually the year that I got pregnant with Liana, which was 2016. Um, they ended up doing an x-ray, and unfortunately, when my dentist saw the x-ray, he saw that second molar slanted like this, and that's because there's no support. There's basically a gap. There's no tooth at all. So that molar is literally like this. So, let's just think about it. If I were to do an implant, there's no space for an implant. If I do a bridge, unfortunately, there's also no space for that. I remember just asking him like, so what is my option? Like, what's my other option if I can't do an implant or a bridge? And he brought up braces. He was like, go ahead and get some consultations with orthodontics and see what they can do i ended up going with one orthodontics at that time and that's actually the one right here behind me um loved him loved the idea the plan is with the braces kind of move that basically i now have all of my wisdom teeth um, out so the plan is that second molar and the wisdom kind of moving them forward so that I can fill in that gap so I thought that was perfect I was like oh you know I like I like the idea let's do it and then that same week I find out I'm pregnant with Liana so unfortunately on the paper it did say if I'm pregnant I couldn't get the braces so I was like crap I had to put it on the side and you know I was focused on my pregnancy had Liana I was planning on coming back to um, to kind of get started on getting braces, but then I get pregnant again. So it just never happened. Like it never happened. Finally, just recently, um, after I had Leandro, I ended up going to my dentist appointment because throughout the pregnancy, I didn't go at all. And they did another x-ray and that's when he finally said, seriously are you going to do something about that and that's when i finally said yes i am no more waiting no more joking around no more saying oh yeah i'm gonna get them i'm just gonna go do it this time i decided to go and do um consultations with three different uh three different orthodontics sorry I'm talking so fast because I'm nervous the reason why I just wanted to see my options as far as payment um, the process um, if it's a for sure thing that they can um, do like to fill in that gap and I still ended up going with the first one that I originally had came to do a consultation about almost three years ago. I decided to go with this doctor. Um, he just made me feel so comfortable. Today I want to do like a little journey of me getting braces and kind of share with you guys because I, I understand there's a lot of people that want to get braces but I can see them being nervous about it. And not only that, even though I don't need braces at all but because we're fixing that issue, I'm also excited because I am getting 
um, like a lot of crowded um, or crowding down here my lower teeth and that's for the the same reason why there's a gap so all of my teeth are shifting and it's just crowded and I'm just excited because you know now I'm able to fix my bottom teeth and overall just by getting my braces I'm just excited on the fact that I'm gonna have a nice smile I feel like a lot of people don't feel confident in their smile because of their teeth or whatever but you know it's true you know sometimes when I smile like I'm just like and and I have this habit and my husband knows my family knows maybe my friends know but every time I laugh or something I cover my mouth and that's because I just don't have confidence in my smile I don't know why and that's why a lot of people are very shocked to hear like really you don't need braces why are you getting braces but that's overall the reason why I'm getting braces is just to fix that issue that I have. Like I said, a lot of people just get them because they just want to straighten out their teeth or whatever. But there are other reasons why people get braces. And hopefully maybe um, if you're one of them where, you know, you're going through the same thing as me, maybe you should consider looking into them. I am very nervous, you guys. I've, I've heard a lot of like scary stories about braces but i start to think like okay if little kids that are 10 years old they have braces why can't i right i'm gonna do it and right now i'm actually outside i'm a little early for my appointment i don't know if my husband is coming oh my god you guys why am i so nervous Ah. I don't know why I'm so nervous. I hate this. It's gonna be so crazy looking back to this clip and kind of realizing like, man, why was I so nervous? Um, but I do appreciate like all my family and friends that know they've sent me like a text like, good luck. Yeah, we shall see you guys. So hopefully, um, hopefully y'all stick around in my new journey with braces. I still don't know how how it's going to be. I don't know the procedure. I don't know what they're going to provide. I don't I don't know. The type of braces I'm getting, actually, I forgot to mention that. Um, I'm getting, they're called the Damon braces. They're basically similar to the traditional, but these are mainly for adults. They're going to be doing the Damon braces. And as far as I know, the top ones are going to be ceramic, and then the bottom ones are going to be metal. Hopefully... They look good. They they say that they tend to do it that way so that we're a little bit more comfortable like showing them off. They said it is a faster process. They did estimate like 24 months with braces. I hope it's not that long. I hope it's not past 24. I mean, 24 is good, but I hope it's less, not more. We shall see. I'm going to keep y'all posted. So yeah, let's go ahead and go inside so I can start this process. By the way, I just took some Advil because they did tell me to take some um, at least an hour prior to my appointment. And don't mind my house slippers. <laughs> Every time I get off from work, I change into these. braces oh my god I feel so weird so the top ones are the clear or ceramic ones and then the bottoms are the metal uh, right now it is hard for me to talk like I feel weird I, I feel like yanking these off one thing that's weird is that when I bite down like um, I'm biting down on the brackets that are like back here but he just said you know once I eat like kind of be careful don't bite you know too hard but the process took about two hours uh it took so long um because when they were putting on the wire the top bracket which was this one came off and we had to wait for um the doctor to kind of go back and fix it and then when they were doing the wire at the bottom this one came off i didn't mind it i honestly 
love it there i feel like everybody that works there were very patient very um making me feel comfortable any question that i had they would answer the doctor was awesome too he just kept telling me like are you okay are you okay and i would be like yeah any little question i had like as far as the biting and things like that he just said yeah it's very very normal um but then art had to leave he had to leave so he didn't get a chance to see like my whole mouth full of braces so he's very um i'm sure he's nervous to see me he's probably gonna be like what the hell you look weird <laughs> right now i'm at my mom's house the kids haven't seen well liana hasn't seen me um, my mom hasn't seen me so i just want to see what they're gonna say another thing he actually said to enjoy kind of like my last good meal <laughs> uh he's so funny he said enjoy like a burger or something because after two hours or after you have dinner your mouth is going to be really sore and just keep taking Tylenol. so i know i have some advil but i do need to go to target and just kind of get like a few snacks like jello or yogurts just anything soft at the moment they gave me this like little gift bag gift bag well you know what i mean like um just the things you know of what how to take care of your teeth um they gave me like a travel toothbrush floss stuff like that they did show me how to like take care of them and then they gave me a no-no list and it kind of explains like all the stuff that i can't have or eat because you know it's gonna mess up my braces this is where my journey starts so we shall see how this goes but yeah right now um let me go get in let me go ahead and get my kids because i need to see my kids all right i just got home <laughs> sorry liana's crying because she just woke up from a nap yeah. but i just got home i have my mouth covered art hasn't seen me are you ready yeah. are you nervous what well, i'm waiting to see you ready yeah Oh wow. Did you go to prom with me? <laughs> <laughs> I have nice. my braces. They what do you nice. think? They look really good. Yeah. No, I'm not used to them. Oh, yeah. Did you go to prom with me? Oh lord. <laughs> Let's go see what Liana wants. Alrighty you guys, it is the end of the day. It is almost 10 o'clock. Yay! Yay! <laughs> um, one thing about my braces is I couldn't eat. Um, I did notice that the wires in the back, like where it ends, uh, they're, they're poking me a lot. I think they're too long, so I'm gonna try to go in tomorrow and get that, um, have them cut it a little bit more so that it's not poking me. Eating uh, was very hard, I'm not gonna lie. It was very hard, very uncomfortable, but hopefully I will get used to it. Hopefully for those of you who are interested in getting braces, um, you kind of get an idea of how it's going to look and feel and things like that. But I will be doing a three month update on my braces. So make sure you subscribe to my channel so that uh, you can look forward to that video. And I will see you guys on my next one. Bye.